Grand Rising, Rise and Shine. Mastering the energies of the mind and the body. Broadcasting live from my inner mind to your mind. From my universe to your universe. Let's dive and ride the cosmic waves. Light being, light body. Understanding the energies of the mind and the body. Right, when we talk about energies, we can also talk about spirit. Spirit and energy basically is the same thing. Spirit is energy. Right, and when we talk about light being, we're going to go into understanding the energies and how it operates inside of the human biological system and the spiritual system. Right, the spiritual system is just the energetic system, which is the positive charge, and the negative charge is the biological system that uses that energy which our body is the vessel for that energy to project it on this earth plane that we are carrying out our lifestyle, right? So, I'm just going to give you some perspective. Um, we we'll start from, from the macro level, right? So, when we look up in the sky, right? Basically, we're getting the cosmic energy. So, everything that is coming from the sky, the sunshine, the air that we breathe in, that is cosmic energy and that is what we call a positive energy, the electric charge. That electric charge is generated mostly in our neuron cells because our neuron cells is what controls all the functions throughout the rest of the body, right? The five senses throughout the body. Now, in order for the physical body to carry out that action that is coming from the cosmic energy, the sun, the moon, Ear that we breathe it have to go through the chakra system what is the chakra system the chakra system is the endocrine system that is the biological system that sends out hormones and pheromones right from the endocrine system to give the physical body which is our vessel the information of what to do and that's all the cosmic energy basically flows through this biological system all right so now if the body is blocked from food toxin and other emotional traps basically that cosmic energy that positive energy that's supposed to be coming through the neuron cells pineal gland hypothalamus basically it can't flow through the chakra system which is the endocrine system and the, basically the biological system cannot carry out the functions the highest function of the cosmic energy the sun moon and the star the positive energy so basically you know the negative energy with the positive energy basically flow drop into a lower density right and that is why most of us based upon how we grew up what kind of you know way of life that we learn we basically learn how to destroy our body to destruct our body right because we don't understand the energies of our body and how it actually works Right. All of us are light beings. We have first it's light, then air, prana, then liquid, then you have solid. Right? So we are mostly light and liquid. Then density come less. So you have a lot of persons out there right now that actually not eating food, not at all, just prana and sunshine. Which you know later down in my journey I'm gonna be treading down that road. Right? And the reason why I can, you know, express this, because it's not an opinion, because I've, I've already pushed myself through these um, experiences in terms of changing up my diet. And not only that, because diet is one thing. The diet is what just clears the mind to see more into my thoughts so I can actually move more into understanding the technology of the body and the whole spiritual aspects of the universe and how the cosmic energy works through the body, all right? So everywhere we go, which we call, everywhere we go, this cosmic energy follows us, which we call the spirit, right? In religions, we say spirit. What we know, most people call it spirit, but it's just energy. It's just electrical energy that moves with us everywhere we go. But based on our body function, the chemical reaction inside of our body, based on that, that's the amount of energy we're going to accumulate to basically take care of the system. So in a essence, the body can heal itself based on the amount of cosmic energy 
that we have inside of the body to express throughout the body so the body can maintain a balance and we can carry through this journey called life right so that's why we have illness this ease of the mind this ease in the body because why our way of life caused the body to block up so the cosmic energy cannot flow through the body and our body deteriorate and that's when we call it aging and we get old and we get sick and all these different things basically the body not conductive enough not conducive enough to conduct the energy that is coming from the cosmic force from the sunshine from the food now you know you have different levels and different stages into getting into this so you want to start as small as you can because you don't want to shock yourself as for me i start out with like three day one day fasting two day juicing and you take your time you know throughout the month to try that or every other month then i move it up to seven days two days water fasting five days juicing and you try to have more fruits right so you start to take your time you know nurture the body and the mind into developing a new way of life because you don't want to shock yourself into it right because you want to you're not only cleaning out toxin and losing weight and getting rid of body fat but you're removing whole paradigm of the mind whole consciousness all emotional traumas you're moving all those things out the way so you have to be mindful to gradually nurture the body meanwhile going through those things right now the more you eat more electrical food then the more the body become more conductive to take the energy from the cosmos because remember the energy from the cosmos is straight electrical energy energy pure electric energy coming from the sun and that is what our body needs to function at the highest consciousness right so it's not about the flesh only it's mind over matter mind over the body if the body become the master of the mind then we have problem that's why we fall into lower density and why we see so much negativity happen because the body is ru ruling the mind the mind supposed to be ruling the body this is above this is below right this is the heavens right and this is below the heavens so you can't have the body controlling the mind the body is an extension of the mind right this is what use most of the positive energy and when i say positive it doesn't mean that this is negative it means that electric charge the electric charge which is a neuron says comes from here then it sends signals to here to let me move my fingers let me talk let me see let me smell let me taste right so if this is not in control of this then basically this is going to eat anything that it feels like look on anything that it feels like smell anything it wants to smell listen to anything it wants to listen and do other uh, activities that is not conducive for this body makeup and that is why we end up living we're living out of sync with our own self and living against our own self because the mind is not in control of the body right so once you remove those high density food toxins start to get more in tune with nature start to ground yourself on the earth start to get more sunshine purify the system then you're going to realize that you're going to be more in tune with the cosmic energy and then the mind is going to be more in control of the body right to make sure the mind and the body and the heart and the gut is working in equilibrium in balance and not one above but working together and not against each other so you don't want to make the body right move off on its own leave the mind right so this is the controller right this is what sends the signals from the cosmic force to give the body what to do so if that is out of order then basically the entire body is out of order and that is why we get sick and that is why we out of balance out of sync disconnected from nature disconnected from ourself disconnected from our soul disconnected from our spiritual essence of life right so those are the things that we need to do to get ourselves in line moving on after you you can go further into maybe a 21 day then a 28 days and that's when you you realize that every time you go further then you're going to realize more things are going to open up you yourself are going to see what you need to always put inside of your life to enhance you to keep going further the aim is being consistent right you can't do it one time of the week two times you have to stay on your program if it's seven days you have to stay entire seven day until it's finished if it's 21 day 
you have to finish the 21 days until the 21 days is finished you can't do half and then leave that half for another two months time not saying that it's it won't happen but when you do it like that it makes the process much more longer but again don't pressure yourself right because everything is a learning process just know that anything that you're doing you have to do it consistently for the period of time that you get and that's when you're going to see the real result right so reconnecting with the light body right the source energy the god within right there's no big thing there's no out of the world thing there's no far-fetched thing to actually reach to this because i am there not fully there but i am there and doing this process now for over three years right and that's why i'm sharing message like this to help guide you guys right to be on the same frequency of thought to tap into the cosmic energy into your light being within your own self right and there is ways and means how we do this and how we go about it and we have to put all together right we call it synchronism study astrology understand your mind study food understand the minerals of the food understand the sun the benefit from the sun and it affects our melanin and our melatonin and help balance our endocrine system which is our chakra system understand our neurons that send signals to the body right and understand grounding from the earth because when we get all this positive charge that's coming from above then we need to ground that positive charge on the earth so we can get the balanced energy to express what is coming from the source what is coming from the god mind right and that is how we stay connected into the stream of life right and always can express yourself and live a life of fulfillment good so you start where you are start where you at and you will see the the mind will guide the body and guide you into where you need to be next so you don't have to go worry about it and put fear into it just start where you at and you will see the mind will start to tell you more where you need to be all right that's basically it. there's nothing to worry about you just have to start the process right just as though i start my process three years ago back in 2016 17 18 19 three years ago back in 2016 and here i am right now right sharing the message making videos and putting programs together and still moving to more higher heights right so as i said start where you at go vegetarian pescetarian go vegan until you can step it up and go more raw and less cook until eventually you know you grow into where the mind is taking it as for me you understand i'm taking it to another level again because i realized that there's more level to this and environment also play a role and more fasting which you have dry fasting wet fasting water fasting then food fasting right and you have some persons out there that is breatharian that doesn't eat any food at all which that is another level but as i said you take your time so for me i'm going into another level another dimension of inside of my own mind you understand because there's more level and there's a lot of level inside of your own mind but you have to be fearful right you have to have a lot of courage determination in order to go down this path and if you really want to know thyself and if you really want to make that connection with the cosmos if you really want to make that connection with god then that's the way you have to do this right so and that's a wrap hope this one help I'll see you guys again so keep riding the waves in the cosmos and we need that light in the body light body light being mastering the energies of the mind and the body all right so remember start from where you at and the mind will take you to where you need to be all right don't have any fear